What is going on guys? My name is Ron back again from Ron Reviews here with another episode reaction to Mushoku Tensei. I said this in my last video, but happy Mother's Day to anyone who's celebrating it or have mothers. Say happy Mother's Day, unless you're in a country that doesn't have Mother's Day, then by all means. Uh, yeah, but anyways, um, this is turning point three. If you don't remember, every turning point has something, well, turned. <laughs> Usually the story takes a turn. This entire part so far has been nothing but relatively nice. There was some drama. The last episode was phenomenal, though, with storytelling. Phenomenal storytelling. And a lot of people said, yes, they did cut some of it out, but it was a great adaptation. And yes, I cried. I cheered up. No, I'm sorry. I didn't cry. Ninjas were cutting up onions in the background. They're assholes. But it was a great scene. A lot of things. Great episode. I'm curious on what's going to happen on this episode. I'm on a bit of a time crunch, so I'm going to be jumping right into it. But yes, let's get forward and let's jump in to episode six. Well, episode 18, but yes, episode six, six in the part. But yeah, episode 18, turn point three of Mashoka Tensei starting in three, two, one, let's jam. Oh boy, I, I have a feeling this is going to be a, uh, this is going to be one of those episodes. I mean, got to keep up with the tradition. Please smile and wave back. Oh, yay. I know some people like were pointing out like Norm was terrified of Rudius, but I'm glad they're getting this. They got that. They got over the hurdle. Probably a, probably a documentary. Although I don't know how documentaries will work in, you know, this kind of world. Could Chief Ramplin read all about it? It's more of a newspaper, but you know what I mean. Writer's block on the first couple paragraphs. I know um, Rudy says, I believe, 16 right here? 16 or 17. All right. I've already seen the intro, so we're skipping it. I'm going to say that every time. Why is he just staring at Aisha? Huh? Something's on her mind. Praise me. Oh, well, I got the P right. Although I don't know what the puppy dog guys are for. It's probably not something he's... he's you are pull okay now you're just working them no oh To be fair, yeah, not that, not in that kind of way. I wasn't, I was, I didn't go there. I'm pure. Work in the trade. Oh. 
No. Work the system. I forgot. Um, I think someone pointed out. I think they're like nine. That's scary. <laughs> I don't even remember what I was like when I was nine, but not even close. Aisha's is cute. In a wholesome way, you perverts. I know there's someone out there. Maybe not my viewers, but. That's fair. Voldemort. It's oh. <laughs> very true. Oh, he's thinking good. Who would have thought? Not me. It's so weird. You had to, I always had to keep on reminding myself that Zanaba is like ripped. Hey, he's he's really he's really fit underneath all that those clothes. One great thing about this show is as you're watching this, it doesn't feel like you're watching a giant time skip. You get to feel like Rudius is constantly growing and it feels super natural, like super space natural. Like it feels very not forced whatsoever. It feels real. And that's what I like about this. It's almost like a chastity. So where's the turning point?
I do miss that. It's the one thing I do miss from my old relationship. Uh-oh. Worry look on her face. Someone's here. Oh, never mind. Don't tell me you're pregnant. What are you going to say? She she's worried. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no there's gonna be more to this it can't be okay turn to point is usually pretty big i mean this is a big shock but not enough to warrant i feel um the title of turning point so we'll see I'm happy. Happy for him. But God forbid having a baby in this economy. Whew. You have to be making some good money on both sides. Well, this is where I live, you know what I mean? Oh. Turning point. Someone hit the subtitles. Excuse me. Whoa, we're going, we're here again? He's going to go, isn't he?
He's getting emotional. I know. I get I get his side though. Why are you thinking that though? Shoot, that's true. <sighs> yes, but which one's the worst? What a great opportunity. Great opportunity. What, Eris? Is he going to see Eris? There's no way. There's only one real answer, by the way. I'm sure she'll be fine with it. Actually, you know what? Funnily, like I joke about that, but low key, I kind of feel like she would actually be okay with that because it's Sylphie. She's too so sweet for this world. So, who's he gonna pick? I mean, if you don't pick Cat Girl, you're wrong. I'm sorry. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Oh no, don't change your mind. Don't change your mind. Have sex with the cat girl. Just do it. <laughs> okay. Stay and have sex with the cat girl. <laughs> He's going to try to find a way to contact them in some way. Oh, he's using anything to, like, convince him. Huh. Yeah. No, don't do that. He'll wait for you. She's, I think she's saying that too. Oh, so he's getting conflicted in opinions. Fair.
Well, that is promising. I mm, oh no, what are you gonna do? Oh, we're at the credits already. Oh boy. Oh no. Don't do it. Stay. Have sex with the cat girl. Oh no, he's gonna leave. Oh no. No. You stupid. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Yes, and then have sex with the cat girl. <laughs> You're not packing, are you? Okay. Norn? No! Norn was planning on leaving! No, Norn! No, Norn! Don't do it, Norn. Oh. Oh, no, that's gonna spur him. Oh, oh no. Why won't you go? I knew it. And he can't explain, like, literally a god is telling me. Oh, no. No, oh, no. I gotta make a prediction. This journey is gonna cause someone to die. You know, it wouldn't make sense to have the mom die after all this trouble. It's probably gonna cause multiple people to die, but it's probably gonna cause a main character to die. It's probably gonna be Paul. This trip is gonna cause Paul's death. That's the, gonna be the big regret. You fought, you went to go save your family and ended up losing one by going. How? Maybe it was an accident, don't know, but him being there is the reason why. Oh man. But I'm, okay, so now that we know, I'm curious on what the, on what the, um, what that great opportunity is if he were to stay. It's either, oh, not Eris, it could have been Roxy. Roxy probably would have stick come by. I'm, t sorry, I'm telling you, he should have just stayed, supported his wife, Raised his baby, took care of his sisters, although Norm would have been pissed. I get it, you just reconciled, and now she's mad at you again. But it's one of those you just don't understand, girl. He could have done that, had sex with the cat girl. I think it's Linnea. Because I keep on getting those names confused. Had sex with cat girl. And yeah, I, I'm, oh, oh. It would be either Eris coming back or Roxy coming back. And he hadn't seen Roxy in years, almost a decade, I believe. He's 16 now. When's the last time? Sorry. Eight? Man, we'll see. I don't remember. 
But yeah, um, I think that would have been the great opportunity. It's probably actually leans more towards Roxy because Roxy has at least we know in the vicinity, I guess you could say. Maybe not in the same continent, but relatively close by. Um, we don't know where Eris is, really, but yeah. Oh, boy. This is going to be interesting. But yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Yeah, uh, this is going to end up well. That's my prediction. I don't see them killing off Zenith. I think they're going to kill off Paul because of what he's going to do. Don't, don't, don't tell me, though. Just let me figure it out on my own. But that's the only thing I can deduce. But yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Happy Mother's Day to everyone. Tell your mother Happy Mother's Day. If you still have one around or in your life, show her that you show her that she you you care for her. You know what I mean? Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on Wednesday. See ya.